Hi guys, it's uh, Ewan here in the uh, lovely sunny Switzerland. Um, so, on behalf of Drone Services USA, I'm going to bring in the new Pro Search Elite. So, what is the Pro Search Elite? Well, Pro Search Elite is the next generation of the traditional Pro Search that we already have. Now difference between this and the normal pro search uh, are a couple of things um, for one as you can see it's significantly larger now there's a reason for that is we have decided that one of the criticisms we had from the original or rather feedback rather not the criticisms is that operators would like to see more independency between the payload system and the aircraft as well now we think this is a good idea uh, strategically and um, that's the way things are going to be going and typically on search and rescue missions so essentially this has been designed to take a larger payload system than the traditional uh, pro search it will be designed to take uh, to for a dual operator role so the pilot and the, op the payload operator will be separate they both have their own video feeds they'll have full independent control um, and it's, we also have some great plans for how this is going to develop. This can also function as a payload delivery system for the Pro Cargo 4 system. So we're hoping this will take up to around 4 kilograms of payload as well. So it has dual functions as well. We will be looking at full 3-axis uh, sensor, stabilized sensor uh, bays, looking to about 3 cameras for the sensor operator. The traditional infrareds, we're looking at uh, agriculture, multiple spectrum cameras, we're going to be loaded into there. But specifically, the main focus that we've looked at for this has been search and rescue. So we're looking at zoom cameras, infrareds, normal optics, these sorts of things. We're also going to integrate it with the Pro X, uh, there'll be more on that coming later, um, which will give us a real value add when it comes to search and rescue. So. As we can see, just a quick another introduction to the airframe, we've got, it's, uh, it's a traditional hexacopter, uh, looking at around 18, uh, 18 inch props, it's significantly heavier than the original Pro Search. This is running uh, about 7 kilograms, um, so it's significantly heavier. It does handle differently, obviously, it's much heavier. but. We'll be looking at the high resolution GPS that we had in original Pro Search. We'll be looking at the LiDAR terrain following capabilities from the original Pro Search as well. Uh, the drivetrain is the same. Uh, we're at least using the same type of power system. So that we'll be looking to try and achieve very long range and a good economy for a, ve a vehicle of this size. Now, traditionally, a vehicle of this size, you'll be looking at 15 to 20 minutes. Uh, we'll be looking to exceed much more than that. So, um, as I said, that's enough of the introduction. Let's do a couple of in-flight videos. Um, and stay tuned for more videos as we go forward, because we'll be introducing each of the features as, as we go along. Okay, that's enough for now. So let's see the rest of the footage.